Hey friends, with you Sitaram are you watching RD Group of Management Training Academy. Today we will talk about the Aviation Introduction Module of Airlines. Aviation is the special practical aspect or art or aeronautics, being the design, development, production, operation and use of aircraft, especially heavier than aircraft. The word aviation was coined by French writer and former naval officer Gabriel Le Landel in 1873, from the verb avir, synonymous flying, itself derived from the Latin word avis, bird, and the suffix antian. Aviation industry, the aviation industry is the business sector dedicated to manufacturing and operating all types of aircraft. Air traffic controllers, when they are awake, are concerned with aviation safety. Airlines, an airline is a company that provides air transport services for traveling passengers and freight. Airlines utilize aircraft to supply these services and may from partnerships of alliances with other airlines for code share agreements. Generally, airlines companies are recognized with an air operating certificate or license issued by a governmental aviation body. Airlines vary in size, from small domestic airlines to full services international services. Airline services can be categorized as being intercontinental, domestic, regional, or international, and may be operated as scheduled services or charters. The largest airlines currently is American Airlines Group. One a scheduled fright is a trip by airplane, glider or other aircraft that has been planned for a certain time and date. Airlines sell tickets for schedules flights to help travelers get from one destination to another. Tickets prices for schedules flights vary depending on the airlines. Two non-schedules air transport services passenger means air transport services other than schedules air transport services as defined in the Rule 3 of the Aircraft Rules, 1937. Three charter operations is an operation for hire and reward in which the departure time, departure location and arrival location are specially negotiated with the customer or the customer's representative for entire aircraft. No ticket is sold to individual passenger for such operation. Four cargo airlines, all articles, good, materials, merchandise, or wares carried on board an aircraft, ship, train or truck and for which an airway bill, or bill of landing, or other receipt issued by the carrier. Airline personnel, the various types of airlines personnel include, flight operations personnel including flight safety personnel. 1. Flight crew, responsible for the operation of the aircraft. Flight crew members include, pilots, captain and first officer, flight engineer and or a navigator require in some older aircraft also flight attendants, led by a purser on larger aircraft, in-flight security personnel on some airlines. 2. Ground crew, responsible for operation at airports. Ground crew members include, aircraft maintenance engineer responsible for certifying the aircraft for flight and management of aircraft maintenance. Mechanical engineers, responsible for airframe, power plant and electrical systems maintenance. Avionics engineer responsible for electric system and, radio system and instruments maintenance. Airframe and power plant technician responsible for airframe, power plant. Flight dispatcher baggage handlers ramp agents remote centralized weight and balancing gate agents ticket agents passenger service agents such as airlines long employees reservation agents usually but not always at facilities outside the airport. Crew schedules. Airlines follow a corporate structure where each broad area of operation such as maintenance, flight operation including flight safety, and passenger service is supervised by a vice president. Larger airlines often appoint vice president to oversee each of the airline's hub as well. 
Airlines employ lawyers to deal with regulatory procedures and other administrative tasks.